up guys it's Jake here from the new uh, channel called Random Box HD and today I'm going to be showing you how to unlock the pack punch machine on a new Nazi Zombies map Ascension. So uh, first thing you want to do is turn on the power obviously and then uh, find the first lander here and ride it right back to the mainframe. Uh, the way to do this is basically you just have to find all the landers and ride them back to the mainframe and then there's a second part of this which I will show after we uh, link every lander. Alright, so I like to typically start off with this one right here because it's first and usually you pass it on the way to the powers. Most people don't really take the downstairs route. Well, from what I found of playing people, I usually take the upstairs route as you can um, basically, I don't know, get to, not really get to the box faster, but you have a better route because you have more spaces to run in for, away from the zombies. So you see here, we're uh, going to the second um, lander which I'm just waiting for my friends to open the door because I was saving money to uh, buy a perk for a second video which you guys will see in um, a different day. Uh, yeah, so we're a new channel, Random Box HD, and we're just trying to produce some good content. We focus on Minecraft, Nazi Zombies, Black Ops, well, I mean, the multiplayer version of Black Ops, and uh, Halo Reach. So uh, check out our other videos, and uh, here I'm going to be doing the second lander. Just gonna wait for it to uh, come. It's kind of annoying sometimes how you have to wait for the landers to refuel, especially when you're like in a situation when everyone's kind of screwed and you run out of ammo. And, you know, just gotta get out of there pretty quickly. So I don't really. I mean, I like the teleporters and I like the landers, but teleporters are quicker. Landers, I guess, are more entertaining to watch. So here, I guess, you know, we're just arguing over us to pay for the lander. I know we're, we're pretty good Nazi zombies players, but we definitely argue over who has to pay for what a lot. I mean, who doesn't? Alright, so we're uh, approaching the um, mainframe, I like to call it. I'm not really sure what it's actually called. And uh, we're going to go to the third lander, and then we're going to head up back up to the power room. Uh, as you can notice here, uh, I'm pretty much taking the same route as before. This is quickest route. I would always recommend going this way when you have to do anything related. Um, to power landers, perks, just go take this route. The un the only time I recommend taking the under route is if you have to um, get Juggernaut. And here's just fast forwarding because they were refusing to open the door. Typical. And uh, yep, here we go. Finally open the door. And this is the last lander here. This is, um, I've heard that there's a glitch also in this spot that's going to be patched soon. I have a plan to upload a video showing you guys that glitch. Again, arguing over the door. Seriously? Who took oh, apparently no one wants to open that. Uh, people in their uh, Nazi zombies points. Alright, so uh, Greg finally opens the door, and uh, we're just going to head over to the last lander, link it, and then go to the mainframe. And, uh, I guess Liam wants his 30 seconds of fame here, and he got it. He'll also get his... Uh, 30 seconds of fame in our next video in which the lander actually kills him which I think you guys will find pretty hilarious so yeah you guys check out our other videos we got Matt working on Minecraft, Greg working on Halo Reach me and Macaulay working on zombies, we got Kevin editing we got Xander, Nick and Liam, we got them working on a Black Ops multiplayer so yeah after you're done watching this check out our other videos alright so we're gonna look at the last lander right here is the mainframe and then we're gonna head up to the power room and uh launch that big rocket which uh, will release the pack punch machine room as you notice there there's a green bar that has to fill up all the way once you do that that's kind of like the rocket's feel I would say um, and once that's filled up all the way to green then the pack punch machine is completely 100% open as soon as you press that button up there on the crawlers um, many people say that uh, if you shoot the uh, rocket as it's lifting off of a ray gun you can destroy it um, I wasn't really sure if this was just a kinda like a myth but um, I sh tried today with uh, my friend Nick and we uh, proved that you could shoot it and it does blow up but I don't show that in this video so I'm um, shooting the green bar to show you guys that that has to be filled up all the way if it's not filled up all the way then you must have missed the lander and uh, I don't think there's any particular orders in which the landers go, I just think they're uh, random. So I mean you can do it any order you want. Similar to the teleporters and Dorees. So here we're going to be watching the rocket lift off and then we're going to head underneath to look at the pack punch machine. 
I wouldn't really recommend this pack of lunch room as a good camping spot. Like as we know, five was um had a very good pack of lunch machine room. But uh, the good thing about this one is that it doesn't disappear like Kino Dare. You have to teleport to in your timed, and then five if you leave the room, it goes away. This is kind of like similar to the Darius pack of lunch machine. You just link it, and you can use it whenever you want, which I think is pretty nice. I like that better. So we're just gonna head up in here, and I'm gonna show you guys pack of lunch machine room. Fortunately, I don't have enough money to upgrade anything. So that's been it uh, for now.